I'm sure you've heard of those high-priced exotic juices being marketed. You know, the ones that no one ever heard of before, that so many people fail to ever make a dime from. They can be great stuff, but let me ask you, when's the last time you heard of someone craving a gogi berry juice to get them through the day? Ever heard of an Akai juice break room? Or someone inviting someone else to go have a mangosteen juice? You get the picture. Even if these products really did cure illness and disease as they claim, they'd still be considered luxury items in today's economy more than ever. Coffee, on the other hand, is not a luxury. It's a necessity. It's an addiction. And now it's a virtual cash machine in every cup. So wouldn't you rather make a ton of cash with something people are already addicted to, but at the same time giving them a healthy alternative to the poisonous stuff while helping them to look and feel great at the same time? Are you ready to be the next coffee millionaire? What if you made a nickel every time anyone from any part of the world purchased a cup of coffee from one of those popular coffee chain boutiques? You'd be a multi-millionaire within just a few short weeks, wouldn't you? Let's face it, coffee is a legalized drug. People know it's bad for them, but they drink it anyway. And some serious coffee consumers can't even start their day without first having copious amounts of caffeine electrifying their brain and body. You've seen the bumper sticker. Gimme coffee and nobody gets hurt. <laughs> right now, there is an amazing window of opportunity that has just opened up, if you recognize it. Right now, you're in the right place at just the right time to receive hundreds or even thousands per week in cold hard cash just for sharing your love of coffee with others who need the extra boost to get them through the day. It's been said by those in the know that this is the greatest consumable product in business history and you could be next in line to pocket the profit. Like what you've heard so far? You haven't heard anything yet. Everyone knows coffee is bad for you, right? It's a well-known fact that coffee is acidic in nature. Many health practitioners today believe the pH or acidity in a person's system has a great deal to do with their health. Just imagine all those cups of coffee consumed on a daily basis by millions of people. They're so addicted to the stuff that they're willingly poisoning themselves and paying for it. Now, I don't know about you, but I couldn't sleep at night knowing that I'm making money off poisoning people. But what if a new kind of coffee hit the market that had the same rich flavor, the same great taste, and produced the same electric pickup found in the finest gourmet blends, only it didn't bring you down, wasn't poisonous like regular coffee, and actually made you feel good? How is this even possible? It's all thanks to an ancient secret called Ganoderma lucidium. When it was discovered, it was referred to as the king of herbs by Chinese emperors who coveted it for themselves. According to Wikipedia, the world's largest online encyclopedia, Ganoderma is reported to have been used in traditional Chinese medicine now for more than 4,000 years, making it one of the oldest known and most powerful secrets of Chinese medicine. And it's still used to this day. People who drink this coffee as a healthier alternative often report that it tastes just like fine coffee but they feel even more alert without the jitters or inevitable crash that comes afterwards. It's a mixture of the highest grade certified organic Ganoderma and very rich tasting fair trade coffee, which makes for the finest blend of gourmet coffee available. Some even call it a miracle. Folks who drink this coffee every day often report feeling great and never getting sick. And it costs about the same as any regular coffee you'd pick up at your local grocery store. 